guys, welcome back to The Coal Factory. It's Raquel. Today's video is going to be a review on the Black Like Me Four Natural Coal Hydrate Pudding. You guys know the categories that I review every product. I'll start with the packaging, then the price, I'll move on to the application, then the quality and size, and lastly the results. Before we start this review, please subscribe to my channel and also follow me on social media. The first category is the packaging. Honestly, I could not find this on the shelves in clicks. I was looking and looking and looking and I was like, I know it's here. I know that click stocks black like me, but this did not stand out in the hair care aisle at all. Again, this is just my personal review. I think that the black and orange for me, even though black and orange, you know, traditionally go well together, in this case, I think that the orange is just way too subtle for me. This is also very small, but we'll talk about size in a little bit. The packaging for me is very basic. On the packaging, there is zero information on sulfates, parabens, as well as silicones. And I did reach out to the Black Like Me team, and they told me that this product has sulfates, it has parabens, and it has silicones. So if you're using this product, if you choose to use it, please use it knowing that this product does contain those harmful chemicals. This curl hydrate pudding does have moringa as well as citrus extract, and you can smell the citrus extract. When it comes to the directions, it tells you that you must use it on clean hair, and it also says that you must apply a generous amount of the pudding in the palm of your hands and work it through your hair. You can use your fingers or a wide tooth comb. When it comes to the packaging, I think that this is very average. So the rating I'm going to give it is 3 out of 5. That's 3 cults. The second category is the price. I bought it at Clicks for 39 Rand and 99 cents. And that is a fabulous price point. I love the price point under 40 Rand for a styler. I think that's a really good price. On the other hand, knowing that you're going to be putting something on your hair with all of those chemicals, you can kind of weigh, you know, the trade-off for the price versus the quality, but you know, we'll talk about quality and size a little bit later on. I think it's a good price point, just talking on price for a styler. So the rating I'm going to give it for price is four out of five, that's four curls. Category number three is the application. This comes in a tub, so you just need to unscrew it, and it's white in color. You can smell that citrus extract. It does smell really, really nice, and it is a pudding. It's not a gel. It's not a cream. It's a pudding, and here it is on my hand. The texture is very thick, very creamy. The texture actually feels quite luxurious. If I think about other luxurious creams, if I'm talking about a cream styler, that's how it feels and that's very surprising. During the application process, I found that I had to use a lot on my hair. I found that it did give my curls definition, but I found that personally, I just had to use a lot of the product and I started worrying because I did feel that the tub was a little bit small. Overall, I liked the application. I liked how it clumped my curls together. So for application, the rating I'm going to give it is 4 out of 5. That's 4 curls. Now we're going to talk about the quality and size and we'll start off with the size. This product is 250 milliliters. It is on the small side, even though I know we have to consider the price point. So for 250 milliliters, I think it's a little small. When it comes to quality, this has sulfates, this has parabens, this has silicone in it. So quality isn't very good. It does have some moringa and citrus extract that does help with some hydration. This product didn't leave my hair really hydrated and it didn't strip my hair either. However, my hair is on the healthy side. If you're going to continuously use a product that has sulfate, silicones, and parabens, it is going to dry your hair out and it is going to take your hair from a healthy state to an unhealthy state. I try all of these products out because I want to give a review on, on it. 
Generally, I stick to no sulfates, no parabens, no silicones, no mineral oil, no petroleum. I really do try to stick to that unless I'm going to be using a product now and again to do a review for you guys. So if you're using this and this is one of your staples, please be careful. So the rating I'm going to give it for quality and size is going to be below average. So the rating will be 2.5 out of 5. That's 2.5 curls. And finally is the results. I did like the results. That I'll be honest with you. I was very impressed when I used this pudding. The price and at that point, so the time when I was using this off camera, I was like, I think there's parabens, I think there's silicones but I'm gonna use it anyway. I did like the results and I have seen many of you on Facebook as well as Instagram having amazing results from this product. It does give you good results, but in the long term, I don't think it's going to be very beneficial to you here. So please take that into consideration. But if you're going to just be doing a wash and go, now and again, put it in your hair, you will like the results. It's not in my hair today, but you know, I'm just kind of flipping my hair for emphasis. So the rating I'm going to give it for results is 3.5 out of 5. That's 3.5 curls. Thanks for watching this review on the Black Like Me for Naturals Curl Hydrate Pudding. I hope you enjoyed it. I really enjoyed doing reviews for you guys. Let me know in the comments if you've tried this product, if you've heard about it, if you have any questions, and I'll be more than happy to answer please subscribe to my YouTube channel and also follow me on social media. I post new videos on Mondays as well as on Thursdays. So please check out my channel on those two days. I also have some really cool videos as well, tutorials, comparisons, and other reviews. So please check that out before you click away from my channel. I'll see you all again in another video. Take care.